Hey guys, Brian and Aaron here from Five to Go. We are coming to you with a tour, but not of our room. Not of ours. But the one we're gonna go into is really similar. It's so similar. It's crazy how similar yes. it is. So we are in Chattanooga. This is our first stop on our summer caravan. And we're with some road runners, Yay. who are what we call our patrons, yep. which I'm sure you've heard us talk about before. Um, and they are parked in this beautiful little buddy site with us here at the KOA. And uh, they have agreed to let us give you guys a tour, tour of their rig. Right. They are full timers. They have been since December. I think so. December of 2020. Mm -hmm. And uh, so they, they're they relatively new to it in the grand scheme of things. But their rig is beautiful. Their rig is beautiful. You guys are in for a treat. Because they don't have three kids. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> they do have one, but she's not here right now. Yes. So Erin is going to lead the tour with our friend Jonathan. Yep. You ready? Yes. All right. The rig that we're gonna go into is a Holiday Rambler Vacationer 35K and it's a 2016 model. And more importantly, that is their beautiful dog, Harp. Look at her. Who How is just is lovely. She? So let's go meet Harp real quick. Because <laughs> <laughs> that's girl. the most important part. Hey, sweetheart. Oh, he's just so cute. <laughs> so let's go Here ahead and knock. Go. See if he's home. Welcome, friends. Hello. Hello. How are you? Come in. Alrighty, before we get started, it smells amazing in here, just so you know. I did wear my deodorant today. <laughs> There's also candles. <laughs> this is Jonathan and his beautiful wife, Kate, and their daughter, Anna, live here full time. We do, yes. And, it's just um, Jonathan this evening, though. Yes. Yep, we just have Jonathan this evening. The girls are gone. So... You want to start up front? Let's start up front and show you how different this is from ours. What you okay. got going on up here? Well, we have also have two cats. We have Aria and Davos. And this is kind of their domain in the front area. They sit up in the front cockpit area and uh, just enjoy the views. And not when we're driving down the road, but <laughs> when we're stationary. Um, and they have these really nice, like, like muslin that? cloth almost kind of yeah. thing. And it just, it just makes it look more homey here. <laughs> we try to make it comfortable. Yeah. We, moved, we moved out of our home and wanted to make this a comfortable homey space. That's so. really nice. And then they keep their trash can up here. So if you're always looking for ideas of where to put the trash can, because we are still. Yeah. Um, theirs is up here and out of the way. This is a common struggle for our being. Yeah. We, we have struggled very much uh, trying to find the right um, <laughs> trash can that fits in right. the area. And then this is your, can your pantry storage here? Pantry storage. So we have food and we have uh, drinks for both the child and the adult. Understood, so. understood. <laughs> and then you don't have a dinette. We do yeah. not, no, we have This a, is nice. Yeah, we have a table here, we have two chairs, and then this will convert to my office during the daytime, which- And we will show that stay later. Stay tuned. We'll work on that. <laughs> but then there's storage in this part, right? I mean, you have drawers and stuff in here? Yes, we have slide out. I keep a lot of my digital media there okay. for work and uh, various different uh, cables and all that good stuff. Gotta have cables, man. Got tons it. of cables. <laughs> tons of cables. And over here, you didn't look, but like we have the queen size bed. You guys just have deeper cabinets. Right. Unfortunately, I've I've asked you if we could go ahead and trade that right. part of the uh, <laughs> RV, but Carol unfortunately, likes her bed. yeah, <laughs> we would. Our daughter, uh, she actually she sleeps on our couch here, but uh, we would love for her to have that type mm -hmm. of uh, option. It is a nice space. It yeah, nice that was one thing we needed. Sure. Let's see, do we want to do kitchen? Yeah, let's do the kitchen since we're right here. Okay. It looks exactly like ours. Yes. Which is yes. really strange, but you do have a door here. We do. We do not have a yeah. door there. And then convection oven. Yes, convection, and... microwave. Uh, we decided uh, because of the solar that we have on uh, top and the batteries that we carry, we tried to change everything over from propane over to uh, induction and electrical so that we can control that. So like ours, you don't have the oven here, you just have the cooktop, but you don't use ours, yours either. We use the induction as well. Not at all. Um, and this is something that you guys brought, bought additionally, like on top of this to use, right? Absolutely. Didn't come with the rig. And then what's no. this? This is our very well used air fryer. The Ooh. great thing about this is that it actually drops down. So oh, we'll move this out of the way. When you need to air fry, you have this where you need it, but Alrighty. when you want to have your space to chop up some vegetables or whatnot, you've got that. You can move it out of the way. That That's pretty really cool. Well. Do you happen to know a model number or a name? 
It's a that? ninja. Um, yeah. I don't remember the exact model number, but we'll get that. Okay, yeah, we'll, we'll track it down. It'll it'll be in the description down below. Yeah, we'll see yep. if we can find that for you guys. And, and then, then that's use. the cat's water, right? That's the cat's yeah. water. I, I walked right. in, I was like, that's weird. Yes. <laughs> yeah, they they love to sip and drink water pretty regularly. Nice. Hopefully cool. they'll make uh, you an know appearance. an appearance. We'll track them down. Yeah, and then every morning uh, I have coffee, mm -hmm. and so we use our induction or not in our induction, but we use our a hot pot electric kettle here. And so uh, that's a Stag EKG, I believe. And we just have our little pour over and we make various different types of nice. coffee. That's way Every fancier day. than me with my instant coffee. Yes. <laughs> that was one of the things that Kate, uh, during my vows, I promised that I would make her coffee every day. And oh. she agreed to marry me. So nice. That was, okay. nice. That was that was something nice. that we... Uh, uh -huh. Bribery always works. It does. It always does. It does. <laughs> now you still have your balances. We yes. do. We are looking forward to, like I mentioned before, we just changed out our couch. Uh, we're looking to do some pretty significant changes uh, to painting and removing the balances, etc. But this is stock. We love when you remove the balances. And, and speaking of stock for a second, you are the second owner. We are. Right, we, you bought this, it from someone? Correct. This is a 2016. We bought it used um, from a woman in France who, uh, unfortunately, because of COVID, was not able to uh, right. stay here. And um, we've had it now for about seven months or so, and uh, we've gone all over the southern United States awesome. with this particular. Awesome. All right, so tell us about the couch, yes. because we have recently done a lot of furniture replacement, and this is not an RV couch. <laughs> it is not an RV couch. It's not a stock couch. Um, as very similar to your couch, um, we had the L shape, the one that came out, mm -hmm. and had the bed that uh, jackknifed. Um, You'll have to show a picture of ours again so they can remember what it looks like. Oh, I, it's like, I can't. I, I can't remember that. It's uh -huh. terrible. <laughs> it's the most uncomfortable couch so is. in the world. I don't know the manufacturer, but I would recommend, you know, let's, <laughs> let's work on comfort at least. Yes. So, um, what we, we looked at various different internet based uh, companies with a couch. The biggest thing for us was to make sure to measure that that space would yes. fit. Yeah. And secondly, that it would come flat packed so that we could get it through the door. That was the most important thing there. Because you didn't build this outside, right? No, we did not. I assembled this indoors here and uh, it's very simple, very easy, but this actually folds out as a jackknife uh, oh, nice. couch as well. Okay. So, nice. It's this crushed velvet. It's very comfortable. We sit here, we watch our, our movies, we watch five to go videos here. Yes. <laughs> We did not pay him to say that. No, 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 not at all. We did feed, but we didn't. Oh, we fed. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> we did. That's true. We had a lovely but, dinner tonight. Now, you have a cabinet over here that we don't have. Okay. Like, uh, we don't have anything that's like That's like this. an end table. Yeah, we yeah. don't have anything like that. That's kind of nice. And the great thing about this is it, it does have uh, the drawers, and our daughter uses this for her various storage, nice. and her clothes are up in about okay. half of these. Okay. Nice. Here, that works. So. That's a good use of that space. Yeah, because you have one, two. These two are huge. Huge. Yeah, we don't have ones that are that big. Anymore. There may be some technology in there too. You know, yeah, I'm a, yeah. I'm a, you need wires. Brian, you need wires. Brian, Brian you need knows. Wires. Yeah. <laughs> HDMI cables. If I if I don't have them in here, You'll you're gonna them. need it. That's right. So. That's right. Uh, so, before we move on, what was the brand on the couch yeah, again? Kind of this is Edlo and Finch. Some something like that. We will we'll write it, it right here. Yeah, right. There it is. And then, I like it. It's beautiful. And then you you have extra storage here. We do. This, um, yeah, and this is a little uh, place to put your feet up whenever you uh, you know are, are lounging. But one of the greatest things that this thing we utilize this for when we're traveling is we actually move this in front of the freezer there to make sure that this doesn't come out when we're driving. Right. Yep, that's one so. struggle we have because we actually we have a tension rod from our freezer to the wall. Uh, the wall next to our half bath. So, but you don't have anything to anchor it against. So. Not at all. Yeah. So that's so. what you've come up with. That's pretty we smart. We did. Yeah. But this refrigerator is the same as it's ours. The same fridge. Same yep. residential fridge with the pull-out freezer. Yep. We love it. We mm -hmm. can we can hold so much yep. food and Yeah. It's and then great. this this whole thing here is very similar to ours, but ours is up in the front. Yep. Right. So, this is a uh, you had an issue with that TV, right? We did prior to uh, this black uh, piece of wood here mm -hmm. that I installed, uh, it, it actually would fold out uh, from the side. And this particular TV is actually, it's uh, Samsung, it's called The Frame. And so when it's not, you know, playing television, mm -hmm. uh, we use it as an art piece because like many RVs, you don't have a lot of places to put your yeah, art. Right. Yeah. And uh, with Kate being an artist and whatnot, we want to mm -hmm. make sure that we 
highlight any art that's out there. Is so. this some of her art? This is not. This You're is gonna actually... have to get some of Kate's art I know, here. I know. <laughs> That would be I think, I think I would have some Bob Ross going on there 24 7. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> I need some happy little trees. Oh, who's this? That's Aria. Aria. That's, Aria. Uh, that's our lady of, um, of the house. I am assuming Aria and Davos. That's Game of Thrones. It's very much Game yep. of Thrones. Good, right. good Absolutely. Absolutely. All right. So you've got the electric fireplace like we do. You did a sound bar because RV sound systems are garbage. It's terrible. Absolutely. Yeah. So we got the little Sonos sound bar. And then your half bath is here. That's correct. Ours is on the other side. Yeah. Yeah. So this is our half half bath here. All right. So you got a full length mirror you added. We do. That's correct. And this is where we charge our our Dyson. Uh, it's a little um, Tornado or Absolute V7. Oh yeah, like the stick back. That's right. Yeah. Okay. That's correct. So. And then you have a vacuum flush. We do. Yeah. Sometimes can be. Um, a little sticky, I mm. think. Is that would that be the proper way to it's, talk about uh, that? I, we'll just call them pains. <laughs> they are. They could be a pain. <laughs> yep. Pain in the rear. And this is the master bedroom. All right. It is a king size bed. Uh, the previous owner did paint in here, so mm -hmm. it, it's not the kind of uh, brownish tan color. We really love your bedroom because it has a lot more space, as you can see. Uh, it's not a lot from a walkway because we can put a washer and dryer in this particular yep. a, a combo unit. Yeah, it's got the louvered doors. We choose yeah. not to. We uh, we do laundry uh, at laundromats and whatnot. We don't want to spend our whole time doing little loads of laundry yep. all day and yeah, every day. That's what we ran into. Absolutely. And then you have, ours has a TV up here. Right. That so had one? It uh, it, like? At one time it had one. The okay. uh, previous owner didn't watch a lot of TV. Okay, uh, she, that's fair. she was a, a spirited woman who just didn't like TV, and so <laughs> just wanted a boondock in the desert. And that's it. Watch the sunset. <laughs> and Yuma, Arizona. Watch the watch the sunset. So yep. she there's a little contact paper there to uh, hmm. you know to make it look like wood. So all right. I'm assuming you use those as closets. Correct. This is yep. my wardrobe. This is Kate's wardrobe. The mirror one. Hi guys. This is also Kate's wardrobe. Uh huh. Yep. She may have a few more clothes than I do. Yep. I've Underneath, heard that this is all shoes under. This here. is her shoe collection. <laughs> Which uh, is lovely. That's so. all right. That's all right. Absolutely. And then yours, yep, this is similar. You have yep. doors under here. You have cabinets under the... We do. The and these room. are actually the most difficult cabinets to even yep. get That's to. That's what I was because, thinking. Yeah, <laughs> they go out oh, about cabinets right and there. Oh, cabinets and drawers. That's all you have. That's, That's as far as that comes That's out. That's as far as it comes out right there. Wow. That's it. That's so, not very useful. I've got t-shirts and whatnot in there. Hmm. So. Okay. Yeah, ours has drawers instead of that, like proper drawers. Mm -hmm. They're nice yeah. drawers. Oh, yeah, yeah they, they pull out just fine. <laughs> <laughs> and this is the master bathroom here. This is uh, much different from ours. Mm -hmm. Yes. I've our shower is on the right, but we don't have that. Yeah, yeah, it's a full full cabinet area there, and we use that for linens and all of our toiletries mm -hmm. and everything. Yeah. So. so the other vacuum flush is here. That's right, and you yeah. can see the light is on there. Like I was speaking yeah, about. Yeah, that's the same control panel. Yep, Correct. Yeah. And then ours has a window. You don't have a window there. No window. Yeah, it's com okay. completely uh, solid there. We do have a lot more cabinet space than we do. We do, which we utilize significantly. Yeah. The cats, we have their litter box. Uh, we keep their food and everything in the uh, shower area when we're not, um, you know, when we're not using the shower. So yep. it's a great place for, for that. And then you have to say it's the same... Like the three-piece glass. Correct. Yep. Yeah, it just okay. slides back. Yep. All right, guys, so Jonathan has a proper office setup that he does in this area here. So we're going to time-lapse this setup. He says it takes seven minutes. So I'm timing you. You ready? Okay, I'm ready. All right, let's do it. I don't know if that was seven minutes, but that was pretty fast. And this is a cool setup. Let's check it out. All right, this is a cool setup, man. Well, thanks. I, I green I screen and everything. You have to. You know, one of the things that I do, I'm forward facing, doing video conferencing pretty regularly. So, you know, when you're in an RV, people always ask, like, what is everything that you've got <laughs> around as opposed to uh -huh. focusing on the content? Yep. So, yep, totally. That's how I've been able to get around that in my Zoom and teams meetings yeah it's cool so this comes out farther correct right. right so we slide this out and I'm able to actually hold the uh, kind of command center where everything hooks up behind the slide so everything's pretty much plugged in 
pretty regularly. Okay, and you have a Mac of some sort hidden down in there? Right, down the at the bottom in, there, in one of the slide outs, I actually mm -hmm. keep the computer there, so I don't even have to worry about that. Okay, it's always and the monitor was living in there. It was in, in that bed. little, uh, we call that the desk. I, we don't, yeah, I don't the, know what else the, to like, call that. hole in the wall, we just right. call it the desk. Yeah, the we desk. just call that the desk. So. It's different from anything else. That's exactly it. Yeah, so this this monster of a monitor lives there. Right, and when we are traveling, we actually lay it on the bed so it doesn't fall down yep. or break yep. or anything Absolutely. like that. And then you have lights. I do. The lights I are do. fancy. You gotta have the lighting, <laughs> uh, not only a, you know the forward-facing light, but I also have the key light, so you can light the back, the green, green screen. Yeah, that is cool. And you've got an air-on chair. Uh, yes. I'm going to admit we did tuck that out of the way for the rest of the tour, but it, Maybe. it lives out here, right? Right, it yeah. does. It okay. normally lives out in this area. I don't put it away unless we have, you know, nice visitors over. Right, <laughs> right. And then is that a Yeti Blue It's a something? Blue Yeti Nano, okay. and yep. uh, it works fantastic. Great audio. Anytime yeah. you're doing online and communication, make sure audio is yep. wonderful. Nice. So this is, this is a great workspace. Yeah, I like, I like really that a lot. Is. We love it, and like I said, about seven minutes, and at the end of the day, whenever I'm done with my meetings, I can take everything away, we can start dinner, and uh, have our open space again. So, nice. utilizing multiple spaces for different things, it's important to do if you're going to live full-time in the RV. Yeah, yeah. If you don't have a lot of space, you got to use it, use it wisely. That's right. Very cool. All right. I'm comfortable here. Yeah. Is that not a wonderful couch? <laughs> this is couch? a great couch. <laughs> All right, so that's a, another rig from another full timer. Yeah. We're gonna do as many of these as we possibly can this summer. Show you guys we're gonna all be camping, the things. Yeah, we'll show you lots of things. We're gonna be camping with, I think it's about 14 other families. Oh my and gosh. many of them are full timers. So we're gonna try and show as many rigs as they will agree to letting us film. <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> so a big thank you to Jonathan and Kate, yep. who's not present, for letting us film their rig. You're welcome. Awesome, I, we, we love seeing how other people live. Especially sure. when they live fancy. <laughs> so, if you have an opportunity to come out on the Roadrunners travel this summer, do it. These these folks are the so much fun. They're great. Oh, Thanks. Didn't pay him to say that. <laughs> 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 All right. Yeah. So so if you would like to join us this summer, we are on the road until August first, going yep. up and down the Midwest. Yep. So we're going Florida to Michigan and back down again. And uh, if you want to join us, head to five to go slash Roadrunners. Sign up and uh, check out our route and come camp with us. Come do it. It's a lot of fun. Yep. Thanks, right. guys. Bye. Bye.